or uh, anti-monument. They wanted to see it come down, but there were several pro-monument supporters who are, of course, really upset about what happened here today. You can still see, again, the pedestal where the Robert E. Lee statue was once standing. And if you look over here to the right of the screen, you can't really see it right now. There's some stoplights there, but you can see the Robert E. Lee statue close to the ground. They're working the statue to get it on a stable ground and stable footing. And right now is George Peterson. Is that correct? That is correct. Hi. George, I know you are a pro-monument monument supporter. What are your thoughts? right now? Well, my thoughts are really focused towards the future and what we need to do to see about undoing all the damage that Mitch Landrieu has done to our city. Yeah, you know, I was at a press conference today, a special address. He talked about how this is a bad symbol of our past, having the Robert E. Lee statue up there. Your thoughts on his remarks? I think he's delusional if you ask me, because Mitch Landrieu has been pushing this narrative for the past two years solely, in my opinion, to further his own political career onto the national stage. Before two years ago, this was a non-issue uh, for the most of the city. Even at the commissions, uh, the public hearings for the land, uh, Historic Landmark Commission and for the Planning Commission two years ago, the majority of the citizens who were there were against this. So, you know, he's only doing this for his own selfish purposes. In your opinion, why should, have they, why should they have stayed up? Because New Orleans is a historic and iconic city, diverse with, you know, everybody's history, culture, and heritage. So my history, culture, and heritage is just as important as your history, culture, and heritage. And, you know, nobody's right of self-identity should be denied them. The word inclusive, which Ms. Landrieu has been throwing around, is not mean to deny other people their, their right to their own self-identity. Right. Thank you so much, George.